Zoom recording. All righty. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Um, thanks for joining the Jenkins Advocacy Outreach SIG. Today is February 22nd. So on the agenda, I have GSOC 2024, Jenkins Award, and the next scale that Mark and I are going to be at. Is there anything else that uh, we should add to the agenda? Yes, I'd like to add the conclusion of the Contributor Summit in Brussels. Do you, and... We can start with that, John Mark, if that's okay with yeah. you. Yeah. yeah, no problem. Yeah. Okay, so there are a couple of uh, um, information that need to be said. So first, it was a successful one, if uh, people uh, didn't hear it already. Uh, good attendance, very good uh, stuff discussed, and was a great moment being together. Uh, we are working, and the we is more directed to Kevin, uh, on a summary uh, blog post to uh, explain what happened and uh, to maybe get more people interested to attend to a next edition. Yeah, uh, thanks for that, the Kevin. The third point is that I secured, bribed with chocolate, the very kind sponsor for the meeting room we had uh, prior to FOSDEM, so that if we want, we can uh, do either a contributor summit or a meetup or just a social event uh, pre FOSDEM uh, in that room. So we have it's for free. Uh, and uh, we just need to confirm that we want a room in October. Although I will be busy with uh, moving to another country and getting into my, my retiree shoes, at that moment, I will continue to handle that and uh, with you here. So if we want to organize something, I have the contacts and it's a good excuse for me to say hello uh, in Brussels and to come back. So I'll continue, if interested, yeah. to look after that event. Um, it could also be great if you introduced me to the lady there, John Mark, yeah. and then I could have it in my um, Rolodex and reach out to her and follow up when we get close to October. Sure, yeah, I'm counting on you to uh, uh, keep me in the loop. Uh, well, I'll, we'll keep in touch also after the summer. Okay, sounds and, good. Uh, so that, well, I'm, I'm, I will be a community member then and uh, just you know I'm ready to help for that so just let me know thank you this Any... is all for contributor awesome okay and then um, so for GSOC 2024 uh, we as you saw we we are accepted into Google summer of code um, we last week we did a part one project idea overview where we covered pro five project ideas, uh, mainly a uh, hi Bruno. So this is mainly for Bruno and Jean Marc. Um, I'm thinking of scheduling the next one for next Tuesday at the same time, which is four p.m. UTC. I did check with Alex. Brandis, and he's going to be available and talk about his project idea. Uh, will you, will these, will this date work for you both? Uh, just checking, I'm sure. Yeah. For me, it's all okay. Yeah. And I think I heard Bruno say something. Yeah, I think I said, uh, fine with me. Okay. Yes, it's okay. Okay. And then I'll follow up with Chris offline um, after the meeting. Yeah. Alrighty. 
And then project idea list is currently updated and uh, current. Thank you, Chris, for that. Uh, let's see what else. And then um, I will communicate with all mentors to be um, keep an eye out for uh, to help review and provide feedback for draft proposals starting now until March 18th, because March 18th is when application begins. It's going to close on the 2nd of April. So we need to uh, review those uh, proposal drafts and provide feedback. And then ranking is due from us on April 24th. Uh, maybe a note, I don't know if it needs to be uh, written down here. I'm working on two draft uh, on Jenkins IO. One is the update of the Jumbotron and the other one is the blog post to announce uh, the selection and to give some hints. So I would need uh, some some eyes there. I just started it. Yeah. So I think we need to update some stuff. So yeah, I can, I'll yeah. work on this with you as well, Jean-Marc, after this call. Yeah. Because I know it's late for you. So I can take it over. But... Still have an hour. Okay. Yeah. And I was planning on reviewing it as well, Jean-Marc, because I saw the pull request and everything come through uh, just before the meeting. So yeah, I'll help as well. Now, where I would need Alyssa and Kevin is that this is... Um just copying the two last year's announcement. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So a little bit uh, rubber stamp. Yeah. So if we could add some yeah. flowers to it. I will. Yeah, there's some updating <laughs> we need to do. So definitely. I'll double check the data in the picture. Got it. Yep. I will do that. Anything else I'm, that I'm missing for GSOC this year? Nope. Uh, we, well, yeah. Um, all mentors need to register on the Google Summer of Code site. Yeah. So a couple of things to, in the, um, on the technical side. And I don't know if you're, you're going to, to do an office hour or not. Um, so this I leave to, to you. I know I like office hours. Oh yeah, yeah. We will definitely need to do that. Um. So you mean the it office will be hours stretching it, later by, on. here? Yeah, to to answer questions for the people that are uh, competing for the proposals. Mm -hmm. Then we can discuss uh, once the contributors are selected. If there it's necessary. Now I I did it that way because I like doing it that way. But uh, choose your your way of doing. Knowing that for Chris it's very late. Uh, yeah, I know. Can be heavy. So just pointing that you have to discuss if you're going to do it or not. Okay, I'll take a look at what we did last year and then. Um... And plan for it. But I think the office hours help. I think last year we did, was it weekly, Jean-Marc, or bi-weekly? Yeah, we, we run it weekly. Okay. We run it. Okay. All right. I shall look into that. Yeah. Anything else before we move on? No? Not for me. Okay. Um, the Jenkins Award, so um, the nominations are closed. Thank you, Bruno, uh, uh, sorry. Thank you, Kevin and uh, Mark for adding the uh, the nominations and wanted to also say congratulations to Chris for his nominate for their nomination. And um, so now it's time to for us to cast our vote. So we can do, voting in for the Jenkins Award as well as the CDF Award, because I know that Kevin has a nomination over there as well. So oh. congratulations, Kevin. 
So don't forget to hop over to CDF Awards and, and nominate, uh, how, not nominate, vote for Kevin. How do you vote? Can you maybe uh, remind us that? How so is, how um, it, you app? would, no. we would put, let me see if I can link to here. Can you still see my screen? Yep. Okay, so I'm moving over to I'm over to GitHub. So the way we vote is add a thumbs right. up. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So um, it's a way we want it to be transparent with the nomination, the voting. That's all. It should take seconds. One vote, or you can vote for all. Just as whatever that you your heart desires, because I think at the end of the day, we would look at the number, the highest number for each right. category. Okay. I think everybody is a winner, to be honest. Yep. Uh, and I could not choose one, but at the end of the day, the highest number gets the um, the trophy. Yep. If you will. If, if you have a communication, maybe uh, just give a hint that this is a technique. Yes. Or, but as Kevin said, there is documentation explaining. Yeah, I should read the documentation. Um, yes, but I will. No, that's a good point because I will send out a tweet because voting starts today um, until March 22nd. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. How can we vote for getting on um, the CDF awards? So you go to the, um, here we go. Glad I put this link here. So I am showing the CDF site right now, Bruno. Yeah. And so if let's say Kevin is under documenter. So I click on that and then. Kevin... Oh, it's the very same way. You put the thumbs yeah. up and you're done. Yeah, oh, cool. Right, right. There is an issue per award. Mm -hmm. Got it, and, thank you. Uh... Yeah, we try not to do anything different from what CDF does. You're nominated too, Bruno. Yes. Uh, I know. Uh, <laughs> For Minijin. For yeah. Minijin. Thank, thank you so much. Bruno and I share the same problem of not wanting to talk about ourselves like that. So, yeah, uh, I, yeah, I nominated Bruno because I think Bruno is great and deserves the nomination in and of itself. Agreed. But yeah, um, uh, yeah, I'm not going to say the same for myself, though. So, but yeah, Bruno yeah, deserves it for sure. Um, All good. <laughs> All good. We will. We'll keep the, the, that offline, but we definitely think that both of you, mm -hmm. we all contribute a lot. In, uh, yeah, in you both point. deserve it. So, yep. yeah, so just want to throw that out there that you, we can, you can vote for both Jenkins Award and the CDF Award. Um, and then Mark and I will be at scale, which is in uh, Southern California in Los Angeles um march 14th to the 17th that's gonna be our in-person event that we're there uh every year so we will have a booth there that thanks to scale they um donate it to us it's a 10 by 10 booth space so which is quite decent for us um so glad to be there again this year for free um and then i will be on vacation april 3rd to the 19th Right. Um, but I should be able to take care of stuff before I go. Um, and then I'll reach out to the appropriate folks to could help me keep the ball rolling while I'm out, because that's going to be a period where grading is going to take place. Um, it's going to, and, and, and selection is going to take place, yeah. but Events. I'll, yeah, it's important time, but I will be back on the 19th. Well, the, the 19th is a Friday, so I'll be back the Monday after that. Um, so I should be able to make the deadline to submit the um, that the ranking into the GSOC portal so that we are on schedule. Okay. Um, anything else that we need to discuss before we end? Uh, I just wanted to highlight, Alyssa, we published Tim Jacome's Contributor Spotlight yesterday. Um, oh, yes. I just put the link in the chat, so we have it here. But uh, yeah, uh, Tim Jacome's Contributor Spotlight uh, was published yesterday, uh, same day as the uh, latest release. So uh, wanted to make sure that that's not lost in the shuffle of everything else going on. No, worth, worth mentioning. Good point. 
Yeah, but thanks a lot for that, uh, Kevin. Yeah. I learned a few things about Jim, by the way. So that's pretty useful. Uh, you know, you you discover the real person behind the committer. That's yeah. a great work. Thank you. Yeah. yeah. Oh, thank, thank you, Bruno. I enjoy you... reading all these stories, actually. So yeah. highly recommend. Yeah. And I think yeah. Kevin likes to do these interviews, and, and they're very useful. Yeah. I have yeah. found a lot of common ground with folks that I never thought I would. And I think, especially with the Contributor Summit now in kind of uh, the rear view at this point, it's a really nice supplement to that where uh, I was able to meet everyone, have the Contributor Summit experience, and now... Um, the, this is the the other side of it. That nice background that uh, even in the nicest of circumstances you might not get. So it, it's just really great to have that um, that side of the contributors and the community being shown. Yeah. Well yeah. Done. Yeah. I hope we can keep adding more people to this list because uh, building up this site, I think it's awesome. Definitely. All righty. That's it. Have We're a good, good evening. Have a good day. Thank you very much. Thank, Thank you. you. Okay. Bye. Bye, everybody.